for Roberta's. Roberta's has had a phenomenal, phenomenal year here at QVC. And it's time for the Petunias. The Petunias are here after selling out last year and they've never ever been back so far in 2020. Devin, Wallin, is that right, sir? Hey, Rick, how you doing? I'm doing great. Is that right? This is the first appearance of the Petunias? This is the first. We've been saving it for you because these Petunias are large and in charge just like you. That's funny. I'll take it. One, two, three, four, five, six. Right up front, just right off the top, you're getting six of these, okay? For a price mm -hmm. that then becomes these guys. That becomes this bountiful wonder of color and beauty. Um, yeah. Hey, Rick, uh, you know, if, if you could uh, turn that table around, it's actually uh, backwards right now, showing the back of the plant. Here we go. I'll turn this one around. There, there we turn go. This one around. There you go. Turn that one around. There. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We got this one. I got it. I'm turning. I'm doing it. We're turning. As we're doing that. There we go. Yeah. Hey, tell me about the petunia and tell me the Roberta's petunia story. Well, so these sumo petunias, they are one of the hottest petunias that you can grow. And the reason that we love them is because they pack a huge punch. They call them the sumo petunias, actually, because they are strong and they are sturdy in the garden. A lot of times petunias, you know, they will, uh, they'll get, you know, if there's a heavy rainfall, the petunias will just kind of falter and they won't look very great. But these ones will bounce back quick and easily. And like a sumo, they have these big old bellies. And that's kind of why they call them the sumos is because while you're starting with a plant that may, you know, at the beginning, it may look small. Each one of your six plants, they grow about four to five feet wide. So one collection is going to cover like a 20 square foot area. So that's what people love about them. They're one of the fastest growing, largest growing best, most flower-covered petunias that you can possibly grow. Okay, that's awesome. Let's do this again. So now we got the setup right, right? So this guy right okay. here, I'm buying this right now, six of these. This is going to be yes. one of the large, this is and, and most popular in its category, by the way, when it comes to petunias. This becomes this guy this particular season. Is that right? That's right. You know, wow. we're only we only had room on that table for three plants, and you're actually getting six. So you can imagine what incredible coverage this collection has. You're getting three of like that rich magenta pink, and then you're getting three of what we call the glacial, glacial pink. And so imagine lining like your, your walkways or placing them around your Tuesday pool. Every time you get out of that Tuesday pool, you, you know, you're, you're welcomed by the beautiful flowers from May to June to July to August to September, all the way into October. And Yo that is what we love about these. You're, you're going to be getting flowers that entire time. The entire time. That's wow. why they're so. That's why these plants are so sweet because they're continually producing new flowers and new flowers and new flowers. That's why you know we all love petunias, but some of them get really leggy and they'll only produce flowers in certain areas of the plant. But these ones will produce plant uh, produce your flowers all over the entire plant. So that's they're like this gorgeous mound, just like that's one you know. When you're looking at these pictures and you're seeing uh, these uh, petunias in a pot, that was only one of the plants, and they are rapid growers, growing about three to five feet around each one of your six plants. So the thing is, for, for anybody who's watching right now, the time to order your Robertas is like yesterday. So, I mean, the time totally. is now because it's going to be time to take these and plant these. All six of them sold out last time, and if we sell out tonight during Patio and Garden, they're not coming back for the rest of the season. So this is an opportunity. And sometimes we have, you know, so many different items. It could be fashion, it could be cookware that come in a choice of colors. This is not a choice of colors. You're getting all of these colors, right, Devin? Yeah, you're getting both colors. And um, many gardeners love to fill out their beddings every single year. And this is, the, this is the best petunia that you can put in your flower beds. A lot of gardeners, they like to get three or four of these collections and plant them all around their garden because they are the most vigorous mounding petunias that you can grow. Um, they, they really will just cover large swaths of area with pure color. Um, you know, we were just looking at the, at the picture with, uh, with me kind of by that flower bedding and like seeing all of those flowers 
in that gorgeous bed, it just totally transforms your state of mind. And that's the state of mind that we want to be at all summer long. Give me, um, give me some, you know, I like, I like to kind of go back to basics, you know, right? Being no the perfect. expert gardener that I am. Uh, go back to basics. Where are these planted? How far apart? How much sun? How far apart? Yeah. How much water? Give me, so, the, give me the basics. Absolutely. So petunias, you know, petunias are a sun lover. Um, they, you, you can plant them in the full, the full baking sun. You can plant them in a the half day of sun as well. I love seeing them along borders, kind of like on the walkways. If you have those um, solar lights lining your walkways, plant these underneath and you'll enjoy the color all during the day. And then at night, your solar lights will kind of make them glow. And it's such a cool sight to see if you're hanging out on your, on your patio or porch and you got your solar lights illuminating your flowers. And then in terms of watering, you know, these can, they, they like to be watered on a regular basis. Um, but the cool thing is, a lot of petunias, they don't like, they can't handle heavy summer rain showers without getting damaged, but these ones don't care. These can handle the heavy summer, you know, monsoon rains that we get here in Pennsylvania or yeah. back in Indiana, and they're going to bounce back perfectly fine. I know. Um, so, hey, in, Sorry? I was going to say, Devin, we got, we're, we're wrapping this up. And one, one last thing, I want to let one more minute. A lot of garden centers are being hit right now. A lot going on, obviously. You guys are still delivering and so for people totally. who can't get out right now what a blessing this is that you can send the flowers right to their door all the way across the country it's a really cool Absolutely. opportunity for people to uh to be a part of Roberta's yeah to have the, the plant shipped to your door free of charge it is you know it truly is a godsend and that is why we're so happy to be able to be bringing the plant life that we're all craving this is such an awesome chance for us to get back to nature to bring nature back into our lives. And the uh, ability for us to bring that to you guys is, it, you know, I, I can't speak more about that. That is, you know, I, I it, it makes my heart feel really good at this time. I know that we've um, got the, we got the tomatoes coming up in just a little bit. Stay tuned for the totally. tomato lovers. Before I let you go, we got thousands of brand new uh, viewers who've never shopped on QVC before. They're shopping for Roberta's. They're shopping on QVC for the very first time. What's your guarantee? How do you stand behind this? Well, we want to make sure you guys are all happy.